So if you want to use the INCO Scorekeeper app, the first thing you need to do is install the actual app itself. So you can download it from the Google Play Store or the Apple App Store. I'm using the Android version. So I've pre-installed mine. Um, so I have it just here, ready to go. So I canceled to use that one because it was a previous one. So what you'll find on your score sheet is you'll, once you've printed it out, is you'll find two sets of QR codes, okay? You're gonna to have to scan them. They're separate QR codes for each distance. So you scan the first one with your phone and then scan the second one once you're ready to start shooting the second round, okay? So we've got our phone and now what we're gonna do is we're gonna press scan QR code. Okay, then the camera's gonna come up and then we're basically going to hover it over the QR code. There you go. And it's found my details. It's got the competition code. It's got the server information. It's given me the title of the competition and it's the qualification. Then I've just got to check that I'm in the right time zone, which I am, Europe and my target number which is 320 on the screen which matches the 320 on the actual score sheet and we're on distance one on the bottom there as well so then i'm happy with that so i press save i can say yes i want to use these values and then we're ready to start scoring so from here all you're basically going to do is enter your three score values for this round because it's an 18 meter indoors so you'll basically just enter your three scores and it will add it up for you. And then you basically press on next archer on the bottom here and carry on. Okay. If you want to clear them, then you can just clear them all by pressing the clear all button, start again. Or if you've entered one incorrectly, you can press on the one that you want to get rid of and then change that out to a six say for instance but on this instance we'll clear again as i'm ready to start shooting now okay so that's fairly straightforward and then when you come to the end of the round uh, you should be able to then scan the second qr code and do it all again okay and that's as easy as it is if you go to the menu you're able to see your whole scorecard your user preferences and your setup as well okay that's what's in the menu I choose menu and go to scorecard. This is my overall scorecard and it gives me uh, my end total values on there. Okay, so I can see the whole thing. Hope you liked the video. Give us a like if you did and don't forget to subscribe to my archery channel. Thanks a lot. See you soon.